Growing and expanding sounds like something great, but people around Lido Key say, stop. A group wants to save Lido Beach Pavilion from a private restaurant from taking it over. Did News reporter Isabel Mascarenas explains why they want to stop developers from changing the nature of the beach. Lido Beach Pavilion offers a taste of old Florida. 79. One many locals say they love, down to the concession stand. Watch for the birds, please. Thank you. Oh, thank you. But the guys are nice. They're local. They, they recognize us. They're down to earth. Sherry Haynes spends her one day off a week at Lido Beach. Word that a new vendor is coming in with big plans is upsetting. I don't want a big company coming in changing our local beaches. Siesta is more for the visitors, for the, the tourists. This is our local spot. This is what our home people do. The group, Save Lido Pavilion, is fighting the city's plans. Their petition has more than a thousand signatures so far and nearly 500 comments. The general public must not be priced out of their own beach for the benefit of corporations. Kathy Antunes heads the group, opposing a 10-year lease with two 10-year options with the owners of the Daiquiri Deck. Instead of 100 seats for the restaurant, it's over 200 with the Tiki Bar. You've got cabanas that will seat up to 90 people. And so when you think of how much pressure will be put on the parking because of the intensification of use, it's an issue, it's a problem, and it's a reason for denial. It's going to drive us away. We're going to go to Bradenton Beach instead of Sarasota Beach. Uh, the footprint will remain essentially the same. Sarasota City oh, Manager uh, Tom Barwin says the city will gain around $200,000 in savings, plus $2 million in improvements. The new vendors will update and maintain the bathrooms. Uh, all noise ordinances, all special event permits still have to be complied with. We tell people it isn't really that dramatic of a change. It, the beach remains open, the parking remains open and free. Please don't do it. Just update what we have, make what we have better. On Lido Beach, Isabel Mascarenas, 10 News. Now the next step is approving the major land use permit. It must first go through the planning board, which meets in the fall. The city commission will give the final approval.